How y'all doing tonight? I'm a little taller. Forgive me if I make some mistakes. You know? Sometimes I feel like I got it 100%, but then, you know, I practice and it's like 98, 99.5%, you know? Let's go. Beautiful. You are the quintessence of that in its greatest form. Beauty. God put effort in you. You're its greatest art. Beautiful you are, your whole soul took the beauty mark. I say, hold it near, because physically, you took beauty far. So why should I leave your side? How could I leave your side? We fell together. So together, we are right. I can't blame you because I'm the one that told you lies. Initially, I sold you out. And then you chose new guys. See, I ain't there to protect you. As this hate interjects you in the facade of compassion, where it seems he accepts you. It took a while for me to realize how it affected you. But he conquered me first, so that he could get you. Divided you from me, intercepted with money. Now it's money over pictures. These women don't love me. See, I admit we are captives, fell adored with his factions. Strip a man of his culture, and you control all his actions. Strip a man of his tongue, and you control what he says. If you control all his resources, you control all his ways. Manipulate his perspective, fill his thoughts with deception. What was once my backbone became ineffective. What was once my balance is now my source of resentment. She was once my other half. Now I despise my reflection. I said, I said, I apologize. I, I can't be your son no more. Our, our standards have faltered. You was once queen, I was once king. You became bitch, I became dog. It wasn't always like this, but in these last couple decades, it became war. See, it became law not to love you no more. See, I found a way to compensate for your full lips, your full hips and beautiful darkness. See, I'm either being a feminized, murdered, or I crossed you off list. I'm either incarcerated physically or must have mentally lost it. I start saying things like, yo, she too rough. Yo, fam, she too tough. Yo, she prone to talk shit. See, every time she challenge us, we call our counterpart bitch. Then we switch faces, we switch tastes and claim that's who our counterpart is. So I apologize. I, I apologize on behalf of that nigga. That weak nigga that looks himself in the mirror and finds faults in what he sees and covers it up and goes as far as convincing himself to believe that it ain't him, it's her. See, I get it. He don't want to pick up his slack, but he expecting you to have his back. Don't, quit. don't get it twisted. I ain't holding up for a mischievous act when she do, nigga. I'm just saying, she is here to protect the children, and the one that protects them both is you, nigga. So I apologize. I apologize on behalf of the black men here nowadays. See, it ain't too many real black men here nowadays. See, black queen, you got the attitude that our black men fear nowadays. They ain't ready to fight back and preserve all that was made. See, you gave him birth in. He want to claim that you ain't worth it. See, he want a different kind of shade. He want to kill the skin that he was made in. So I apologize. I apologize on behalf of that nigga. <laughs> that weak nigga that claims that he gangster but afraid to bang back at his enemies. So they turn to each other or the mother of his child and exert all this energy, his negativity. He aims his artillery in every sense of the word and when she retaliates in every sense of the word, he gets vexed and tears her down. See, 21st century niggas are females now. So I apologize. 
I apologize cause nowadays Haru ain't defending Osar's death. See, I apologize. I apologize, I said. Thank you. Wow. Yo, I got a, I got a book of those, man. I got a book of those. You know what I'm saying? So, um, you know, with, with, with the talent, man, we got to exploit our own talents, you know? So make money off our own talents. So I got a book of those. If, you know, y'all like that, check me out after during the break or whatever. Holla at me. Wow.